spend a little time once in a while thinking about now I'm a scientist doing really well and I know the theory about development and how body parts form, but that it's actually taking place and it's actually a young kid, that is overwhelming. My name is Ulf Ørum. I'm from Denmark and I work at the Max Planck Institute for Molecular Genetics in Berlin. Most people know about genes are in your DNA. And what usually happens with your DNA is that it's made into RNA. And it has been believed for many years that there are 20,000 genes in the human genome. But for the non-coding RNAs, it looks like there are 100,000 genes. So that essentially means that with the discovery of non-coding RNAs, we have found five times as many genes in humans as we thought there were. It's this discovering the unknown, uh, every day working with something that might reveal something nobody ever seen before, that's exciting. It's like a big puzzle. Having a research group at the Max Planck Institute, it really burst your creativity because you have, currently have three people in addition to me in my lab. That means they can do three times as many things that I can do. And I'm putting as much effort as possible into making that a success. Uh, recently, my wife and I had a little daughter, and of course that's becoming a major focus too. I guess I sleep a little less, but it works out pretty well. I like to take my bike. Uh, it's fast, it's convenient, you, you wake up. I thought before I came to Germany that all Germans would stick to the rules, that Germans were very correct. And apparently that doesn't apply to traffic. They don't care about you, they care about their car. Of course I would like to be a father who's present. And of course, if you have to look at the job, of course it takes time and in the long run I probably have to put in more hours than right now. Um, but it, it also inspires you. I mean, it's really, really hard to get uh, new, fantastic ideas if you're stressed and tired and working all the time. If you're happy, if you feel good, if you do things you really like when you're not at work, uh, it really inspires you. In the end, it's really beneficial for your research program too.